My thanks as well for some wonderful presentations and uh, also uh, my regrets to those who are still up at the mic. I'm sure the questions are important and I hope we have time to at least have some um, discussions around the side um, during breaks and so forth um, during the rest of this meeting. So um, please don't uh, let go of those issues. Um, so we're going to move forward now into the next um, session on caffeine effects in the central nervous system. Um, Thomas Gold from Temple University is going to moderate this session. Um, he is director of the neuroscience program, head of the neurobiological investigations of learning and addiction lab, and a professor of psychology at Temple University. His current research is on the neurobiology of learning and memory with a specific focus on identifying the cellular and molecular events that underlie the effects of nicotine and ethanol on learning and memory. And um, so, um, Thomas Gold, would you please um, come forward? Thank you so much. Thank you. The uh, next session, session four, is on caffeine effects on the central nervous system, but it's also meant to set up the panel discussion on the behavioral effects associated with caffeine. We'll have two talks. The first talk will look at the neuropharmacological effects of caffeine. Our speaker will be Dr. Sergey Perret. He is a senior investigator and a chief of the integrative neurobiology section of the National Institute on Drug Abuse Intramural Research Division. Um, our second speaker will be Jennifer Temple. She is an associate professor at the Department of Exercise and Nutrition Sciences and Community Health and Health Behavior. And uh, she will be presenting on the developmental neurobiological effects of caffeine exposure. So, uh, Dr. Ferre, 